Today is Wednesday. How are you all? I hope you're well. And guess what? We have to count. And I know it gets boring, but we have to get it in our brains so that when we go to big school and wear a school uniform, our teachers will be so amazed that we can count so well. So let's zip through the counting. We're going to count to 50. Let's go. One, two, three, four. I can't show your voices. Five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, remember the n, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, all grown up and can drink tea, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-four, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight, twenty-nine and thirty. 31, You are superstars. So we're talking about shapes that are not flat. We're talking about 3D shapes. And today we're going to talk about a shape called a cone. Can you see this little ducky game? It's shaped in a cone. It goes from the point of the duck's head down to the bottom. An ice cream cone is a cone that's upside down that you lick your, your curly cone ice cream on. Now we're going to make a party hat to make a cone. So you've got a paper plate that has a black line and you have to cut and stop. So cut on the line, cut and stop. Now you'll notice that I've already made two holes there for you and I've put sticky tape at the back to make it so that it doesn't tear. Now your first job, and Polly did this for me, she's decorated the whole plate. Now I know we're going to lose some of her picture, but it doesn't matter. You can decorate your plate any way you want to. And here's the tricky part. You need white glue and a brush, or you can have a stapler. If you're going to use glue, you do need your washing cakes. So, have a look. I'm going to paint glue. Watch carefully all along here. And it's just like a slice of cake, as if you're cutting a slice of cake. So I've painted glue like that. Now, the white side is on the top. And look what I'm going to do. I'm going to fold into a party hat my edges must be the same and here there's no glue so I'm going to put a little bit more glue in. Now if I don't have a stapler I can use my washing pegs and if I do have a stapler I can quickly just staple. Then you need your two pieces of ribbon and you're going to thread them through and mum's going to help you to do a double shoelace knot. Now this is getting tricky, it doesn't want to go through, but it will if you be patient. And you're going to make yourself a lovely party hat. I don't have elastic to put on. Everybody who's been making masks has bought all the elastic in the shops, but we can still use it with, um, with ribbon. And now I'm going to take my washing pegs off because I did staple and here is my party hat. My party hat is a cone. So what shape is this? It's a cone. Have a look how beautiful I look. Do you think I look like a princess? I think I'm going to a party. So let's sing this sign. A cone is like a party hat, a party hat, a party hat. A cone is like a party hat. Come and join the fun. A cone is like a party hat, a party hat, a party hat. A cone is like a party hat. Come and join the fun. So can you see my cone? It's got a point. The bottom is round and it comes up like that. Some little huts 
A game reserve safari hut might have a cone for the roof. An ice cream cone is a cone, a party hat is a cone, this toy is a cone. And it's a 3D shape. A cone is a 3D shape. I can't wait to see photographs of you wearing your party hats. Bye-bye.